I lost. Well, I guess that's enough. enough. As I said, you cannot win against me. Our forms can be mimicked, but you can never replicate our inner drive. This is a setup. What is that? Is that the hill where Yasugami High is? The orbs of light are gathering there. of this case intending to... Ah! I must ask that you not needlessly inquire further. Now is not yet the time. Huh. Naoto Shirogane, you will be making your exit here. Die. You dodged. Such a struggle you put up. You're wasting my time. Who are you? I am Minazuki. Show Minazuki. I am the one who will destroy you, Ikirijo fools, and this world. Uh, so, you're the ones who captured Mitsura-san and... Yes, I caught them off guard, just as I did with you here. It seems you're not very perceptive. Though your intuition is impressive. For you to discern our plan after only one battle. It's an absurd scheme. What are you trying to summon with that tower? Don't get me wrong, that in itself is not my objective. All I want is to grant a wish. A wish? Whose? There's no need for you to know. You kidnapped Labrys and attempted to collect our personas before, but that's not the case this time. You're using Mitsura-san and her team as hostages, and you've prepared fake versions of us to fight. Hmm. There's only one reason why you'd create such elaborate imitations of us, even to the point of summoning personas, and have them challenge us. You set this entire scenario up so that we wouldn't think twice about fighting. Again, your intuition is impressive. By forcing you to fight in this fog, I am carving off bits of your personas. Carving off our personas? I've said too much. It seems our guests of honor have arrived. I enjoyed my time with you. If the opportunity arises again, 
I'd like to speak with you further. Labrys? Don't worry now, Takun. I gotcha. Labrys, don't let your guard down. He's the one who attacked Mitsurasan's group. This guy? Our guests of honor have arrived. I've been waiting for you, Shadow Operatives. All this. Who am I? Hmm? That constant question. It's quite intriguing that a machine created for suppressing shadows would ask it, though. What? But first, let me see the rest of you. Ah, quite the persona user. However... Yukari-san, he's winding up for another one! We're getting off, Koromaru! That was close. But now that we're here, you don't get to do whatever you want anymore. Naoto Shiragane, right? Are you all okay? We'll handle this. <laughs> Labrys, I'm trusting Naoto Kun with you. Gotcha! You don't have to worry about a thing now. So you're our enemy. You won't escape now. The players have finally gathered. It's nice to meet you. I am Minazuki. Sho Minazuki. Welcome to his world. I wanted to meet you all, especially Kirijo. You are the ones who killed his father, after all. What's he talking about? Who knows? I don't really care, either. I have no intention of fighting you now. I only wished to see your faces. I'll be heading back now. Take your time here. Don't, Don't get, get the, the wrong, wrong idea. idea. I'll, I'll be your opponent. What the? What's going on? Another now tycoon? <laughs> Don't be deceived. That's an imitation of me. An imitation? Huh. That sounds like the kind of dirty trick they'd pull. Huh. huh. It, it seems, seems I'll, I'll be facing, facing those who are participating in the Grand, Grand Prix, Prix for the first time. time. I, I hate, hate to waste time. time. So, so let's, let's simply begin now. now. Bring, Bring on, on the, the ring! ring. Everyone, get away from me! Hurry! <gasps> Yukari-san, Koromaru, spread out!
What's going on? We what the? Where's the culprit? What? Wait, when did he? <laughs> like I said, I'll be your opponent. Don't worry. A version of myself so close to death, and a machine who's just joined the Shadow Operatives would be pretty sorry prey. So just this once, while no attacks are still allowed from outside the ring, I'll agree to fight whoever enters the arena. Though of course, once you pass those red pillars, invisible walls prevent anyone from leaving until I defeat it in single combat. Invisible walls. <laughs> That's just ridiculous. This is just like the last P1 Grand Prix, except we're in the real world. Hello! General Teddy here! Long time no see, Labby-chan! <gasps> oh, don't look so shocked. Let's see if I can guess what you were thinking. No! You're supposed to be my shadow! Why? Or something like that. Is that Inaba's persona user, Teddy? He doesn't look like a bear to me. He just looks like a plush mascot. Is he dressed up like that on purpose? Oh. You there! Silence in the peanut gallery! How dare you call my bona fides into question! I'll have you know I look bearific! Crap, he heard me. Hm. This is your last chance to push your luck like that. Labby-chan and Nao-chan aren't getting out of here until you win a one-on-one -on -one fight! So, are you okay with that? Are you gonna move on without your friends? Hurry up and decide whether you're gonna enter the ring or not! Will you shut up? Fine, let's do this. I'll go in and... No, please move on! Huh? You can't let him provoke you! The culprit's aim is to make us fight against our doubles, thereby carving off our personas. Carve off our personas? Mitsurasan and the others are within the tower on the hill. It won't be easy, but try and avoid combat with the imitations as you rescue them. Okay, Labrys, we're leaving the rest to you. Oh, what's this? They left you behind. I, I guess, guess that's, that's the extent, extent of this friendship you go on about. That's not true. What, what about, about it is not true? For it seems to me that the others moved on, on leaving you two alone. alone. You clearly have no understanding of the bonds between people. Yeah, what she said. They didn't ditch us. Yukari-san believes in me, so that's why she trusted me to take care of Naoto-kun. And that's why I'm gonna make sure to knock you out of the park myself! What a fantastic battle! We must have gathered a good many Persona fragments just from that alone. <laughs> Was it okay, Naoto-kun? We ended up fighting this thing. There was no getting around it. Our enemy has Mitsuru-san, her friends, and this town hostage. Besides, we had no means of escape. So, everything was set up perfect. Who do you think that Minazuki guy is? I don't know, but... Ah! Ugh! Naoto-kun! Thank you, Labrys. You truly saved my life. Come on, no need to thank me. I told you it was my turn to help you guys out. But what about you, Kun, and them? Just like I thought. 
Though that fake you was a tough customer. What in the world are they? The imitations seem to be crafted from shadows. I'm astonished that they can even copy our persona abilities. But that aside, let's hurry, Labrys. There's actually something I couldn't tell you, Kari-san, earlier. Huh? What's that? It's that young man Minazuki's true objective. He's gathering persona fragments from us in an attempt to summon something hideous. Something hideous? Indeed. He'll use the tower looming on the hill, just as Tartarus was used when Mitsuru-san and her friends were in high school. I don't know what in particular he intends to bring forth, but there's no denying that his aim is something along those lines. Really? Oh yeah, I actually felt something odd about that guy myself. Odd? In what way? Well, when I got close to him, I felt something strange. It was exactly like the feeling I get from those plumes of dusk we have as cores. Oh. Does this mean he had a plume of dusk in his possession? Not exactly. It wasn't that he had one on him. It was more like it was synced up with his heart. It felt just like ours do. Synced with his heart? We'll never lose. You saw us fight earlier, right? Yukari-san and Ken-kun can really kick some ass. It seems you've made some wonderful friends, Labrys. Huh? Oh, uh, huh. You think it's okay for me to think of them that way? It's kinda embarrassing. <laughs> That's how it is at the start. Once you come to realize it, though, You'll find that it turns to a warm feeling within you. Huh. Is that how it was for you, Naotokun? Who knows? Perhaps it was. Let's go rendezvous with the others.